I get you bit video. Okay, now we're here. Uh, wow, look at it, huh? Now we are. We're here now. And, uh, let me see. Bring it closer. I found this tree in a great yard and uh, and I dump it in the pickup truck. Great jar behind behind my building where I work and uh, uh, you know I asked one of the guys what was wrong with this thing because this thing is like new. I throw in the pickup truck, I take it home, play with it. You know and uh, I said oh, you know it was so nice. Huh? Like, you know, the whole thing is like new. The guy said it was a leak. So it was leaking the vapor. I said, oh, okay, uh -huh. take it home and play with it so I could make some videos and stuff. We have some fun over here. Okay, now we're here now. Uh, let's, let, let's, 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 let's look at this number over here. Okay, so now we know it's a train and uh, uh, American Standard. How that was? Train got bought out by American Standard? Oh, American Standard boat train. I don't know how that worked, but I gotta look it up. Okay, now look over here. Numbers over here, huh? Look at those numbers. 48,000 BTU. Now you make that up. Huh? 48,000. So you fix that one out. How much is it? So 12,000 BTU for ton, right? 12,000 or 12,000? It's 24,000. Wow, we're not there yet. So we get, that's two ton, 24,000, two ton, right? We got, we need another two, two more ton. So this means is, this thing over here, is a four ton unit, evaporator, air handler. Okay. Half horsepower, wow, well, big. Whoa, look over here. Can I use it in my house? Too big. Well, I can still hook it up. Well, it's too big. Look at this. Four ton. I only need like a ton and a half of my house. Oh, too bad. I'm gonna take it back to the. I'm gonna take it back to the grape jar. I cannot use it. But just for the hell, let's have some fun today over here. So, it's number over here. Okay. I saw a guy. Yeah. He couldn't tell the customer how many ton was the unit. The only, the only thing he had to do is come over here, look this number, figure that out. He couldn't tell the customer uh, how big was the unit. 48,000 BTU, right over here. Big unit. Breaker, what do you use it for breaker? Circle break over here. Okay. Got a whole bunch of information over here. A lot of fun, good stuff. Good stuff over here. Oh, secret breaker, secret breaker one, secret breaker two. Good stuff. Big limits. Okay. Uh, now, uh, I took the coil hour and everything else. It's over here. I took the coil hour and everything else. You know what, Let, let's have some fun over here. Well, I got this thing pressurized. Put the pressure again. Still waiting to drop. Don't drop it. Somebody said it was a leak over here. Where's my spray bottle? Let's, let's put some, let's, let's spray this, let's spray this baby up. If I can see my spray bottle over here, let's see. Find any leak in this thing. This, this is soap. Okay, so you guys don't get it toxic. I don't see any leg. 200 pounds. I don't see any leg. I won't pull high because I solder this thing over here with regular solder. I don't want this thing blowing my face. So 200 pounds for a leg, 200 psi for a leg. It should be should be enough pressure for me to see any bubble. Can the bubble in this thing over here? Somebody change this thing because uh, it will leak. I don't see no leg. You see anything? You see any leak in this thing? I don't see any leak. Believe me, if it was a leak, 200 PSI, you would notice right away. 
All right. Hey, so for those guys who like super heat, let's. Uh, wait, I got this evaporator over here. I could explain a little bit of super heat. <laughs> Don't you guys love super heat? Come on, let's do. Let's do this record. Let's have some fun over here. Listen, super heat. How it work? Okay. Coming through here as a liquid. Same thing the other side. See, so you got three for this side and three for the other board on the other side, the other panel. Come on, it's a liquid over here. Let's say I'm outside in the house and I'm getting low super heat. Read it. That, what that is telling me what? It's telling me this. It's telling me that liquid's coming through here. Liquid coming through here, low super heat. It's coming to here as a liquid, coming to here the liquid, coming here the liquid. I go around and around and around and around and around, right? And never change the state to a vapor, a low pressure vapor. Okay, never change the state, it's supposed to be changed the state. Now, if we come all the way up to here, this thing's big. Go around, around. And then up here, change the state to vapor. Right from liquid, change to vapor. That uh, vapor, low pressure gas. I say, yeah, low pressure vapor. I think, I think that's the right name, low pressure vapor. Uh, that will be outside, it will give me a really low superheat. Why? Because from here, from here, that's what's called low superheat, where everything happens. Change the state from liquid to low pressure vapor. All right. So what that mean is overcharge. All this is liquid all the way to the bottom. Liquid. Liquid. It could be overcharged. It could be dirty filter. It could be a dirty coil in the back. It could be a dirty coil. So in the next video, I'm gonna show. I'm gonna explain to you how uh, the other part, like a uh, uh, high super heat. How it works.